Well, hello, my YouTube fellas and gals. So today, I have Sunny Fun Time Mouth from Katie's Tribe of Five. She always has good, good stuff at her sales. These ladies can bring it for sure. And I should have had it snipped open. But it's not too bad. Fun, fun stuff. Look at all this goodness. Oh, this is cute. It's a Santa ribbon. Look how pretty that is. I really like that, Katie. And you know if it's got wire in it, you can always take the wire out. Look how pretty that is. Ooh, love that. Looks so vintagey. That will be awesome. For a beautiful Christmas junk journal edition. And then she had these really cool postcards. And one thing about postcards, that if you do not like the front, you can always add cardstock, scrapbooking paper, a picture of your own, and alter it. Look at that. Horses. And a boat. And a statue. That is so cool. Love postcards. Postcards are so much fun to play with, too. Fun, fun items. I put them back in so that later I can pull them out and put them where I have all my little containers full of stuff and collect in plastic containers to put my cards in and all that happy stuff and of course pictures never ever throw pictures away look how beautiful that is that is gorgeous we adopt families through YouTube <laughs> Aw, a little kid in the snow. This is awesome. Look at that. Oh my goodness, it's so stinking cute. Aw, she's so cute. Aw, looky. Little baby girl. These are so adorable. Look at that hair. Look at her hair. <laughs> these are so awesome. A piece of history. We don't know who these people are. Look how cute he is. But we can add families to our journals and preserve pictures. How cute. Look at that grin. It's amazing what you can get at estate sales and places. And we preserve all the memories in our junk turtles. Now I use my family in my in my real my journals. But like when you're making journals to sell and whatnot. These are really cute additions to add, or if I would have a, look how beautiful that is. Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. 
These are so cute. Christmas picture. And there's a card. Ah, oh, that's so pretty. I like that. That's really pretty. It says Christmas greetings from Colorado. Thou snow white cross on a mountain peak in wondrous beauty crowned. Thou biddest me uh, think of Calvary, me and hope the world around. From values where grows the columbine, this prayer I send, Christ joys be thine. That is so pretty. That would be good in my faith journal. But these are the types of stuff that, like I said, if you make a vintage journal and you just want to add extras, these pictures are so nice. They're very complimentary. And then we have all this goodness. Look at this. I, excuse me, I love this. I really do. Sorry for the paper rumble. Love the feel of this too. This is really pretty. You know, a piece like this would even be nice. These type of pieces to wrap a journal in when you sell them. If you don't want to cut them up. This is gorgeous. Katie, you always find fun stuff. So soft. Here's another piece. These are great if you have them in pieces, like if you get holes and stuff in them, if you own stuff like this on your table, instead of pitching them, you can take and cut pieces of these and turn them into snippets. This is a really pretty runner. Fancy. Fancy, fancy. This would be nice to decorate a table like for Thanksgiving down the center. That's pretty. Sometimes you buy stuff, you don't have to always cut it up. You can buy some of this stuff and use it too. I went out shopping many times and I have found doilies that I have turned into, you know, putting on them on my furniture to making them look pretty. And then we have this set for a baby. Look how cute these cards are. Um, there's the cutest little booties. <laughs> These are adorable. And then here's another baby. And then here's a card. If you don't keep the cards, you can always use the pictures. Look how cute that is. For a joyous Christmas. And here's a birthday card. That is so cool. These make great decorations. All the cards that some people throw out. They don't want them anymore. You should actually bundle them up. Take them through a thrift store. And let a crafter get a hold of them. They seem to find our ways into our hands. <laughs> One way or another. And I love how Katie does this. She puts this cute little prayer card. Today's prayer. I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. That's so cool. She puts prayer cards in your orders. I love that. And then we have tax pages. These are cool because you can copy them if you want to. As long as they're out of copyright date. This is from 1890. 
And then here's coupons for three cents. Those are cool. Cool, cool ephemera. And then, of course, of course, of course, I really love the cover of this book. This book is so cool looking. From 1893. Like the cover of this. This would be interesting to read, too. Then, of course, we have a horse, The Path in the Ravine. Look how cool these spines are. This is from 1895. Look at the inside cover. Love it. And then these are fun pages that can be dyed. And look how cool this is. This is like printer tape paper for the old style computers where it had the dots and stuff. Isn't that cool? Nice. They got like little bears. There's two down here. It says Merry Christmas across it. It's really cute paper. Good for journaling. So yes, I really, really love all of the products. Very, very nice, Katie. So whatever time zone you're in, I hope you're having a great one and you stay blessed. And please like, share, and subscribe if you don't know how. So if you want to see future content from me or come visit my live stream, you can find me through notifications. So with that, have a blessed day. Bye.